Well, we know going into the game tonight, the Hartford Whalers had lost two. Count them, yeah. two, two in a row. Yep, I remember. He told us that last night. Oh, they're the most yeah. dangerous. Keep that in mind. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes all the Whalers need is a really good reason to get pumped up for a game, and tonight they found one. The Boston Bruins came to town, and if that doesn't get your green blood boiling, nothing will. The ice looking a little chippy again tonight. A giveaway here. Steve Casper to Sly Turgeon, and the Whalers took a 3-2 lead in the second. Another giveaway in their own end, and Ronnie Francis feeds Kevin Deneen, and the Whalers led it 4-2 after two. But Boston is a team that doesn't quit. Now look at what Rick Middleton had to shoot for right here. What, about three inches? I still don't know how he scored that goal, but he did. It was 4-3, but the Whalers come right back. Paul Lawless takes the puck from Michael Telvin and beats Roberto Romano on the backhander. It was 5-3. Again, a two-goal lead, and again, Boston digs in. And it's Middleton scoring once again, beating Mike Liute. It was 5-4, but just seconds later, watch as Paul Lawless does it again. At the blue line, he lets loose a screamer that beats Romano 6-4. The Whalers win the season series from the Bruins. It was a fun game but not the prettiest one ever played. Kind of a sloppy game, huh? A little bit, both sides. I think so. It, it, it seemed the teams were a little tight at the start. And, you know, the, the puck was bouncing around a bit, and there was giveaways, and, you know, just like Sly's goal, you know, he stepped in and intercepted a pass. And, you know, it, that's not a typical Boston-Hartford game, but I don't think the fans were disappointed. It was exciting, and, you know, it, as all Boston games are. So the final, Whalers 6-4, to four. so at the moment they are four points up on Montreal pending the outcome of their game with Chicago, and right now the Canadiens and the Blackhawks are tied 3-3 in overtime.